I do? Then let me officially welcome you to the first annual Con Cop, you Con 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 Con. <laughs> Wait, what did he say? Connected Computer Continually Conceptualized Conference and Convention. Oh, the Con Comp, you Con 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 Con. Who's ready to have a good time? <laughs> now let me hear the lead in. Oh my. <laughs> They'll be here. And now, please welcome our guests of honor, Steve Hobbs and Steve Bosniak! <laughs> Good to see you guys. Hey, folks. Good to see this guy. Look at him. Steve Bosniak. <gasps> the two biggest tech developers on the planet. And their best friends. Who? Started out in a garage. Just like us. Yeah. As you probably know, the first computer was a useless box. It had a lot of potential, but we had no way to access it. Well, then late one night, Steve and I were sharing a soda pop at the garage when suddenly it hit us. I said, Boz, what if there was a way to turn this computer on? But I said, what if there was a way to turn this computer off? Six years and a lot of sleepless nights and a ton of R&D later, we had it. The computer on-off switch. Whoa. Fun fact, it was originally called the off-on switch. Uh -huh. <laughs> and we did it by following this pyramid of friendship. They really are just like us. We gotta sneak backstage and introduce ourselves. Definitely. You read my diary. Wait, what? Ooh, great hiding spot. I can't wait to see their faces when they find out we snuck backstage to meet them. Oh, yeah. Famous people love when fans jump out at them. Are they here yet? Mm -hmm. Huh? I can't see. There's two guys blocking my view. Who are you guys? Sorry, we're huge fans. We wanted to ask if you had any secret advice that you might not tell an audience, but you would tell to two young inventor friends working out of a garage. <laughs> if that rings a bell. Oh, I get it. You two think you're just like us. You think you're me, and you think you're Bosniak. Wait a minute, why is that guy me? Why can't I be the other guy? Oh, come on, Steve. It doesn't matter who's who. Of course it doesn't matter, because you get to be that guy. Why, I'm so sick of this whole thing. Whoa, whoa, what about the pyramid of friendship? Thanks for the reminder. Now, Steve, I just want to... <laughs> Becoming your partner was the worst decision I ever made! You ruined my life! No, you ruined my life! Oh, Steve, you drive me crazy! I'm done, I've had it! <laughs> la, 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 la. Everyone loves Angela. La 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 la. Can you keep mm -hmm. it down? I can't hear myself playing. Ginger, the world doesn't revolve around you. No, no, it doesn't. Not yet, anyway. I'm trying to write a new song, a smart song, one that will make people think. What rhymes with dance, dance, dance? Um, educational grants, elephants, romance. That's it! I like to dance, dance, dance. Educational grants, grants, grants. Ah, it practically writes itself. If we are just like Hobbs and Bosniak, we're gonna end up hating each other, just like they do. Uh, well, uh, calm down, buddy. We don't know that for sure. But we don't not know that for sure either. Oh, no. You're right. What if the future is locked in and we aren't destined to be friends forever? To, to the, the Future Tron. Tron! The Future Tron is an app that I've been working on that uses metadata to show the future. And I came up with the name Future Tron 6000. Hurry up! Turn this Hurry on up. and put that in there and hold on tight. Thank you. It is an honor to receive the Tech Star of the Year Award. Hey, we're really successful in the future. And we're still best friends. This is a truly remarkable moment for me and the person who inspires me. I'm talking about the man upstairs, 
My boss, the CEO! The man who said to me, Ben, you don't need a partner. You can be successful all on your own. Uh, Ben, do me a favor. Throw this in the limo with the rest of my trophies and uh, bring me a coffee when you come back. I'm sick of this. We were supposed to be partners, and now you just take all the credit. That's because I do all the work. Oh, yeah? We'll work on this. Ah! Ah! I will show you! Ah! 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 You ruined my life! No! You ruined my life! It's even worse than Hobbs and Bosniak. You're successful, and I'm not. Well, that's not a surprise. The scary thing is we weren't friends in the future. How could this happen? It must be that our future friendship is ruined because our current friendship isn't strong enough. Well, tell me there's a way to fix this. Maybe. Nah, it's too crazy. What is it? We have to engage in one-on-one -on -one friendship building activities with music playing in the background. Oh boy, a friendship montage. Well, all the best sitcoms have them. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Ginger. Yes, sir, Mr. Ginger. Don't apologize. I should really thank you two. You were so focused on your friendship that you completely mismanaged your company and had to sell it to me. Sir, you're late for your two o'clock. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a meeting with a giant pile of money. Don't forget to laugh maniacally, Mr. Ginger. Oh, thank you, Angela. <laughs> 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 I don't believe this. The future where we're friends was even worse than the future where we weren't friends. I don't even know where to start this time. I do. <laughs> Honestly, I can't believe you let this happen, Ben. Me? But what happened? You ruined our business? I was trying to save our friendship. Well, friendship doesn't pay the bills, Ben. All right, break it up. Don't you see? You're arguing about things that haven't even happened yet. You're letting the future Tron drive you apart in the present. She's right. Look at what we're doing. But what are we supposed to do? Just sit on the couch, watch TV, and not think about anything except how good our cereal tastes? Hmm. Hey, the crumbs have the same taste as the big pieces. A future where we all live like Hank. <laughs> what would that even look like? Hey, guys, let's try not to forget. We have to go to our book signing tonight, okay? Right. Should we take the supersonic jet or the helicopter? Let's compromise and take the supersonic helijet. Oh, that's why you're the idea, man. Angela, great to see you. Great to see you, Tom. What? Hey! And you, Ben. And especially you, honey. <laughs> Missed you more. <laughs> it's not easy to go a whole morning without seeing the best wife in the universe. Oh, Hank. No! No, 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 no. What are you doing? I'll tell you what I'm doing. I'm doing you a favor. I'm doing all of us a favor. Everything we did to make the future better just ended up ruining the present, and it didn't even make the future better. I think I know what you're saying here. We need to create a future Tron 6001. No, enough is enough. Look, maybe we can make the future better. Maybe we can't, but let's all just enjoy today. No more trying to change the future. So now what do we do? Well, sometimes our TV shows, after the characters learn their lesson, the final scene is just dancing and celebrating. Really? A big dance scene that just comes out of nowhere? 
Well, that seems a bit ridiculous. <laughs>